These are axial CT images through the level of the abdomen and pelvis after the use of intravenous and oral contrast in a 21-year-old female with right lower quadrant pain. As we scroll through the images here within the right lower quadrant, we already see a dilated tubular fluid-filled structure, which is the appendix. It is coming directly off of the cecum here. Notice already that there is, first of all, the appendix is dilated. It's measuring greater than 6 millimeters. There is marked mucosal enhancement of the appendix. Notice also that there is fluid around the appendix as well. And if we scroll up towards the pericolic gutter here, notice that there is a fluid attenuating lesion with peripheral rim enhancement. These findings are all consistent with acute appendicitis. However, one should not be satisfied with just the diagnosis of acute appendicitis. In this case, we have fluid surrounding the appendix, which likely reflects perforation. In addition to that, we have what appears to be a perependiceal abscess here along the right pericolic gutter. So findings in this case would be consistent with acute appendicitis with probable perforation and periappendiceal abscess formation. This patient was taken to surgery and it was confirmed to represent a perforated appendicitis. Appendicitis represents acute inflammation of the appendix. One should always look for perependiceal complications such as perforation, which can be insinuated from free fluid surrounding the appendix or a focal defect within the appendiceal wall. If one also sees extraluminal air, that is also indicative of perforation. Periappendiceal abscess is recognized as a focal low attenuating lesion with peripheral rim enhancement surrounding the appendix as well. So these findings, again, were consistent with acute appendicitis with probable periappendiceal abscess and perforation.